instrument here. Not this particular set, but the drum as an instrument. Yes, beautiful drummer. Where are all the, all the girl drummers That's what represented? I was wondering. Yeah. Way over 100 years. <laughs> yes, over 100 years. Give my mom a round of applause. She lost. So just over a century, actually. It's a, it's a very young instrument. And a lot of traditions around the world have been doing this a lot longer. And India is definitely worth studying. So if you guys know any Indian teachers, I don't know if you guys notice, I'm a, I'm a white guy from Ontario, so I'm not, I'm not a, an authentic expert, but it's something that I've studied a lot. And the whole point is to be able to speak the drums. So using your voice, I wanna go over tonight a lot of disruptive ideas, and one of them is that counting is overused. Like we definitely count, remember we talked about flow in the zone? Man, that's a good way to get you out of the zone. <laughs> one, two, three, right? Like you were doing some counting, versus the boom smack. Do you notice you guys feel different when you do that? Like, do, ta, do, do, ta. Can you guys do that? Yeah, just kind of beatbox, versus like one, two, a three, and four. Now counting's great if you need it. It's almost like saying, taking an aspirin for a headache. You know, if you don't have a headache, you, you kind of don't need it, the aspirin. So yeah, counting is, is good, but speaking is a lot faster and a deeper and a funner way to learn. So the Indian system has something called conical, and it's basically speaking the drums. Yeah, the, the black page, man, right? So Frank Zappa wrote this solo, and it was so, much, so many notes, it's, it looks black, right? The black page. And what really helped me learn it, like, I don't know if I could have learned it with, with conical or without conical. I think to, to have something beyond counting is, is essential. So they've been doing this system for, for hundreds and hundreds of years, maybe thousands of years. And it's really simple. Uh, India is a big place, so there's different ways of doing this. I'm just gonna teach you an entry level system that you, you guys can use for yourself. Two, three, and four, and then I'll show you something I, I created with it. What do you guys think, deal or no deal? Two. So two is taka. 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 Do, do we say quiet people win nothing? Do we, do we, do we go over that, Phil? Do we, do we uh, okay. So taka. Taka. Okay. Everybody gets a prize. 
so three is takita. You guys say that? Takita. Yeah. So four, takadimi. Takadimi. Yeah. So it could be anything on the drums. There's a funny story with. Uh, does everybody know Ed Shaughnessy? I got to s spend some time with him before uh, he passed away. Great. We talk about life the rhythm. You play who you are, right? It's like your best self comes out through the drums. Ed is a great example. That's just a great human being. Awesome guy. And he he studied Conoco just just a little bit, but just enough. And, and he thought it really helped his drumming out, even though he didn't play traditional Indian music. And has anybody seen the drum battles that he did with Buddy Rich yeah. on the Tonight Show? Yeah. So I think they had this. Ed told this story where they, the Buddy's like, "All right." We gotta make a deal beforehand. None of that tacky, tucky, dicky, dicky stuff. And Ed's like, all right, but if if I'm not gonna do that, then none of that cross-handed stuff that you can do. Because I can't do any of that stuff. I was like, okay, deal. Tuck it in, tuck it in, tuck it be da. Tuck it in, tuck it in, tuck it da. Tuck it in, tuck it in, tuck it in, da, da, da. Tuck it in, tuck it in, tuck it in, da, da, da. Tuck it and I can't remember which one of them broke the deal first. I think maybe it was Buddy just threw it across, and it's like, oh, okay, well, tuck it, dimmy, tuck it. But they had this friendly battle because Buddy apparently could, in a drum battle, if he wanted to, he could, he could humiliate. You. But with Ed, it was always like a, like a fun, you know, kind of. As we said, it's don't compete, <coughs> right? So.